All right, so after buying a cheap eBay printer SK375 and not being able to find any way of getting files to go from Inkscape to ArtCut 2009, I'm going to show you the way we found without having to buy any new software to get our files over so we can get them to the plotter. So we'll start off with getting a logo here on Google. Get the Zoo York logo. Low quality, but we'll take the first one. So we'll right click it, save image as. Save it as the Zoo York logo as a JPEG image. Save. close this move the image over open up Inkscape So from here, we'll go to File, Import, we'll take our Zoo York logo, open it up, put the lock on, we'll scale it up for a bigger size. Now we'll go to Object, Path, Trace Bitmap. Edge detection, remove background, live preview, okay. Move this out of the way. And we'll delete that one. Now we'll save this. Save as. Save as a PNG file. We'll leave it as drawing, save to desktop. So we're saving from Inkscape as a PNG. Let's close this down. Now we're gonna go to our drawing, right click our drawing. We're gonna open it with paint. And there's our image in paint. Now go to File, Save As. We'll save it as a JPEG, a JPEG picture. So we'll just word it. Let's say Zoo York JPEG, and we're saving it as a JPEG. Okay. Now we'll close this. We'll move our Zoo York JPEG over. Go to Art Cut 2009. Okay. Create. Now we're going to go to File, Import. We're going to import JPEG. And then we're going to go to our desktop. And from desktop, we're going to find Zoo York JPEG. And there's our Zoo York JPEG. So we'll go to Edit, Select, Highlight, File, Image Tracing, Next, Next, click Height, Height, and Yes. Finish. Now we'll move that one over there. We'll move this one over here. Click off. We want to highlight the one we don't want. Edit. Delete. Move this one back in. 
And from here, we can just go to our Vinyl Plotter tab. You can play with the nodes if you'd like, but we're not going to get into all that. Yes, our image will fit. We're all set up. Cut plot. As you can see, we got just a piece of blank paper with a pen attachment tool, no blades. We're going to go start. And there's our image printing out on the plotter. And that's everything. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps. This is how we did it, and we didn't spend a dime on any additional software, and it seems to work for us.